In this tutorial, uh, we will see how can we initialize a Git repository using command line in our local machine. Because uh, in last tutorial, we saw why do we need or what is the significance of initializing a Git repo in our machine. So in this tutorial, we will try to initialize using command line. Prerequisites for uh, this initialization of Git repo is uh, you need to have some client like Git bash so that you can write commands to initialize a Git repo and it's pretty simple uh, the command is git init so let's do one thing let's launch git bash and uh, run this command so this is the git bash and uh, let me go to one directory which is a temp directory i mean d drive and temp directory now let me write one command which is git init it's done so if you go inside uh, d and temp directory you will see one uh, git directory which is a hidden one so let's go and verify so you can see that now dot git directory is created which is a blank one so you can see that uh, dot git directory is uh, created and it has its own uh, git system level uh, files and directories which you don't need to worry right now and if you see this carefully this is a hidden directory this is all about this tutorial and in the next tutorial we will see how can we initialize a git repository using the .git. So thanks for watching. Bye bye.